G'day guys, it is finally here. The time to drop these YBS Safe Style safety glasses that I've been holding out on you guys for well over a year now. There's two different styles in two different colorways. They're 100% tax deductible. They're polarized. The lenses are almost indestructible. There's no metal parts in there at all. They're super flexy. Not only are these a beast in the workplace, as soon as knockoff happens, or you just want to chuck a sick, you tell the boss to that and get out in the water. I have been testing these and I have been pushing them and they are amazing. They're 100% polarized. This stops the sun getting into the side there and damaging your eyes. Like my eyes are actually cooked because I've been out in the water for so long, so many years. So about time I got some good shades. Before all this happened for me, I was an electrician for well over 10 years in the mining industry. And one thing you had to do was always wear compulsory safety glasses and they sucked. They fog up, they're irritating, they're uncomfy and you bloody look like a kook. But these my friends, we have partnered with SafeStyle and we have created the coolest looking safety glasses on the market. So this is the true story of how this actually happened. I was just chilling at home at Mossland and a lad come around and a bloody good bloke at that and he introduced himself as a guy that just bought my next door neighbor's property and turns out he was a plumber that had just started his own business in designing safety glasses since then they've blown up and the feedback is amazing so he showed me these sunny glasses and i looked at him like this and he looked at me like this and we were just like let's bloody do it if you guys want to get your hands on these head to youngblaze.co you've got to be quick buck there's a very limited amount and i'm not sure if this will be a one-off collaboration with safe style we'll have to see what happens in the future youngblaze.co check them out guys and let's roll straight into this episode it's going to be a bloody bang up Rambo, <laughs> <laughs> so you wanna go to war with me? You're talking like you think you're royalty. You think that I'm afraid, but I don't break. I heard you question my stability. You think I'll fall just like a guillotine, but I am here to stay. Won't look away. Good morning, everyone. It's a bloody fresh one today. Well, for me anyway, I'm freezing, but it's going to be a good day. Strider and I were up early. Jacko, my brother, is on his way around. He's got a day off today. For the first time in a long time, we're getting to see Strider ready, and we're going for a big send today. And I'm going to video basically the whole thing today. You guys know the boys that I've been hanging out with on the tropical island. Well, they're actually here. I'm returning the favor. They've been so good to me. They let me stay at the house, use all their gear. So they're here today at home and we're gonna take them out in the boat and show them a bit of YBS style at home here. And I can't wait, it's been so long since I've been out in the boat, going for a good old mission with you guys. Let's pack it all up, get out there. That sun is just coming up right now over Moss Land and uh, there's not a breath of wind and there's Strider over there. Good morning, Strider. Hello, you wanna go out in the boat, huh? <laughs> oh, I'm so excited for this. Hello, sexies. Let's go. Who is this, Trini? Who's that? Who's that over there? Get him. Go get him. <laughs> Morning, Jacko. Morning. Oh, Trini. You already got You got the one from the island? Yeah. Yeah, just pick whatever, whatever you want, really. See if this one fits your dad. Oh, yeah. We have fire, baby. That's a small. Come on, Strider, did you get? Come on. Oh, someone's gonna have to snuggle with Strider and back up. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> hey, 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 Jacko! Hey, <laughs> the dad bod strikes again. Here we go. <laughs> Alright, here we go. That's not my fault. We're out there. <laughs> We're on. Sun's just coming up now. Strider's absolutely pumped, aren't ya? She's a little 
bit bumpy this morning, just a bit seasick. We're hoping it's going to back off, but we're punching our way out there. Absolutely profit, all the boys are keen as. So I'll uh, see you over the other side. We pulled up to the island here, quick break. The boys are rigging up some reels. Oh, we just got all these new combos from Shimano. Thank you very much, Shimano. So we're going to give them a test out. Got a couple of ghosts and this sweet little twin power here, which I'm super excited about. That looks really good. Chuck some stickies on. And I'm going to punch out to a shoal that I found and we're going to just see what happens. We're hoping it's going to be nice and clear, but at the moment it's super dirty and overcast. So we might go for a flick until we find some viz and then we want to get in the water and go for a dive. But we got all day to just see what happens. Go! Let's go! Go! Oh! <laughs> Swing that bum. Swim it. Swing it. Good girl. Ah, stay there. Just going to ah. explode. Stay there. <laughs> So we just pulled up to these fusiliers, heaps of bait work and we'll chuck in some stickies around and the biggest Mackies come through, like 20 plus. That was a big Mackie. And it came out of it a few times, eh? Nah, there would have been a, a few. Oh, oh yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. Come on! Hit it! Just jumped out of the water, and everything. Oh! No! That was huge! That was, enough, that was so big! Oh! Yep. oh. Oh, yeah. First fish on this little twin is, man, Woo. little Spanish. We didn't hook on one, but it was a bit of carnage, a bit of fun. So we're all going to suit up now, hop in the drink. The Viz looks pretty good considering normally it's really, really bad here. So we're going to suit up, Put hop in, in the drink, and hopefully we can get some fish for dinner later on. And uh, none of us have any fish, so hopefully it's going to be a good day. It's only in the morning. It's only the start. It's already on. Righto, we just suited up now. We're going to hop in the drink. All of the YBS gear. If you want anything, gunblocks.co. But we got to sort out who gets first drop because there's a very good chance there's going to be fish on the bottom straight away. So, rock, scissors, paper. This is going to be the dive order. Ready? One, two, three, shoot. Ready? One, two, three. Oh! oh the <laughs> In there. Big jumpies, boy. First fish of the day, a beautiful little red emperor. We actually just found the spot and I just dropped down to scope it out. 
And when I looked up, I seen it there, I couldn't believe it. And it started swimming away from me. I was gonna try and call Jono in on it or one of the boys, but I had to take a shot because it was gone. But, phew, I'm stoked with that. That's good. I'll just get the spear out. I, I, it's a long shot. Yeah, because he started Darn swimming away. away. And then once they're, once they're out of here, they don't come back, these reds. They'll, they're pretty mellow until they get spooked. And then you'll never see them again. But got the shot in, put it to sleep straight away. The spear didn't even go through, so. Lucky I did. Too big, like Max. Like big Max. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this spot is on. <laughs> Woo! Here again, G. No, don't go near that. That was a sick little spearing session. I haven't done that in a long time, so it's good to get it down there. At the start, it was beautiful viz, no tide, and we got a couple of good fish. Josh is just going for a little jig. He was uh, boating for most of the time with Jacko, so we're gonna go for a bit of a fish. Head back to the beach soon. Pulled up to the beach, we're gonna go for a swim. Strider's gonna go do a little thing. We ended up spending most of the day diving. The time just disappeared. We ended up spending a good six or seven hours in the drink, which is fine by me. We're gonna chill out here for a little bit. And then from here, we're gonna start steaming back towards home, checking out the islands, going for a fish, a jig or whatever on the way back. And uh, we're gonna cook up a feed later on this afternoon or tonight. And I don't plan to get back to the boat ramp well after it goes dark. So we'll just see what happens there, or a little ray there. But yeah, we're gonna drop the anchor in and hang out. I'm gonna get the drone up in the air too, I reckon. Talking like you think you're royalty You think that I'm afraid But I don't break I heard you question my stability You think I'll fall just like a guillotine But I am here to stay Won't look away The storm is coming So you better start running Go 
was trying to. <laughs> she jumped on him. <laughs> Woo! Little J. Or Queenie or something. Queenie maybe? Oh, you foul hooked him. <laughs> Little Queenie. <laughs> yeah, come on up. Yep. In you go. Go on. In you go. Go, 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 go. Go. Go now, Sean. Oh, go now. Yeah. <laughs> Little J. Little J from the roof. There it is. <laughs> it is a little J. We're going to let him go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, bring the line here. You're up. Just then when I had the drone up there, I actually scouted around and it is dead glassy out wide. So we're going to punch out wide and go for a few deep drops in about 70 meters of water. Jig. We've actually kept one of those queenies because it started bleeding. So we're going to use that as bait and see if we can get some big fish off the bottom, baby. Reds, Nanny Guy, Rankin, whatever we can get. Um, we'll see what happens there. Maybe a few gold band snapper or anything like that. And uh, I think there's a few species there that Joshy Boy hasn't got, yeah. so hopefully uh, we can get him some of them. Anyway, we're going. Is everyone all good? Yeah. All right, let's go. All right. Whoa. made it out deep with the boys and we got these new Shimano rods. Me and uh, me and Joshua Boy on the ghosts. We're gonna see what happens. We're just going for a jig first. We did have some bait, but we're gonna see if we can get one on the jig. The sounder was pretty loaded. We haven't drifted over it yet. It's just coming. It's just coming, so. Who knows? Should put some Oh! Oh, that's a good fish! Good fish. Ah, oh, triple! Ah. Yes! What's happened? Ripple! What the fuck? What's happening? Oh, are these a big fish? Oh, oh. These are big fish, boys! Oh. 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 Holy shit! Oh. The drags are locked as I well. I can't do shit! Oh. I can give someone a belt if they want it, but... Yeah, ah, yeah the boys! Oh, triple! Oh! Gee. What the hell just happened? Just like that, I was just about to give oh. up! They're probably Trevally. <laughs> oh, no, is it getting worked with his big They're like reds, eh? All the way up. Head shakes. Anyone got colour? Tell me when you got colour, Josh, and I'll come and grab it if you want. Come on, baby! What do you got, Carla? Come on, come on, come on, Rankin. Oh, you got a Rankin! Woo! Yeah! Good fish! Give it to him, Rankin! Probably a red if you think it's getting sharked. Oh, come on, come on! <laughs> Ooh. That's such a good fish! Here This is locked. It's like fully locked. Oh, he just pulled out. Look, oh, gone. Josh. I don't like the sharks. Oh, look at that! Oh, a bit golden, Trevally. Golden? Oh, yeah. You're kidding. Oh, yours was such a good fish. That was massive. Maybe. Ah. <laughs> oh, oh, that's a huge one. Oh, massive. He might, Holy he might. Oh, that's a big shot. He was swimming off too, look at that. Woo! That was out of control and you got your jig back too yeah, eh? yeah yeah so i just need like an assist yeah i got them oh. Woo! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> ah. those are all the ones <laughs> ah. <laughs> can you give me the rod Wow, that's a good golden Look at the size of this thing! Woo hoo hoo! Oh, big golden, beautiful Rankin. We'll keep the Rankin. I'm gonna get this fella straight back in the drink. Yes! 
That was a triple, straight up. Thank you, mate. You eat. Yes! Spice! Oh, let's go again. That was chaos. Who who hit first? Me. Josh here. And, and then, then you straight away. Yeah, you almost got pulled more. Whoa! You got stuck under the bar and I was pulling him off the floor. It was. It was seesaw. Yeah. <laughs> that's the that's um like a hundred pound braid and, and the big setup. And it was locked up and I was like and it was still breaking my line. Oh, let's go. We got some fresh queen here that we just caught. But uh, John has cut it into pieces and he reckons it's delicious. I've actually never eaten queenfish raw or ever since I've been a young plumber. So, we just taste. Traditionally, queen, queenfish around here is not a known fish to eat, so. <laughs> it's not that good. <laughs> Considering, look, it's not that bad. I've eaten a lot worse, but. Compare it to like a Mackey or anything around here, it's still got that little fishy taste to it, eh? There's a little fishy lingering taste to it. It wasn't that bad. I like how I like how it was chewy and like hard. Some, is good. Yeah, the texture is really good, but just that aftertaste of the fish sort of smelly flavour. But yeah, as far as texture goes, it was really like like a like sort of like a cooked steak, but it was raw. Look at this. Look, 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 at that. look at that, we're in 70 and it is lit up down there. Hopefully a bit of a, another triple hookup. Hey, just after I put it hey, in the first piece. Going backwards and then. Oh, I just had something to miss it then. Oh, oh right there. Oh. Oh, yeah, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Get into it, Jacko, come on. The big dad bod representing all the dad bods out there. It's actually funny, you can see where the fish got taken out of all the others there. See it? Yeah, up it comes. Color? It's a red! It's a red! It's a tomato cod! Oh, it's a huge <laughs> tomato <laughs> cod! <laughs> That's a massive tomato cod! Wow, I'm seeing Oh, nothing. hold it up, Jacko. This fella right here, tomato cod, and they are absolutely delicious eating. Ew! Hold on, Jacko. Strider's not too enthused with fishing at the moment. What are you doing up here, Strider? You good? Hey? Big Trace? I uh, don't know. Oh, that was a good little session on the bottom there. We've got that triple hookup, which was so fun, and a couple little stragglers after that, but we decided to punch in because that sun is on its way down and it's getting really overcast. So I'm hoping a storm but it doesn't blow through, but I want to get back closer to mainland in case it does. And then we're going to cook up feed. On the way, I do have one spot that I want to stop. Try to go for a troll, see if we can pick up a wahoo or a maki. Something like that, but it's all good. Absolutely beautiful day. And yeah, we'll just have to see what happens like normal. Back at mine, we're just unpacking the boat, getting the fish out. Going to get into a little bit of a filling sesh. Beautiful red from today. Blue bone and the Mackie, all beautiful eating size. All right, Josh, you get into that Mackie. Yeah, we've got on this strutter? Here you go. Oh, go on. Okay. Got, Off here. she goes. <laughs> She's out of here. Yeah, yeah. Ah, see the problem. Yes! We got fire, baby. I got it. I, I think it's broken, but. Check that back on without burning myself, if that's even possible. No, <laughs> burnt myself. Fresh Mackie, ready to go. A little bit of green shit, a little bit of red shit there. We're gonna make wraps, you know how we do. And oh man, I haven't eaten all day, so I'm so excited. Right, boys, get into it. I'll grab some secret sauce, actually. Good Jacko? Mm. <laughs> oh, that's legit, eh? That's so good. A little bit of cheese, a little bit of green shit. Bit of red shit. Seafood sauce mixed with the secret sauce. I can't not go a little bit of secret sauce. Right, oh. oh. Ah, skittle. Cheers, guys. That's a bloody wrap, baby. Mmm. Mm. 
second. Mm -hmm. <laughs> of course, of course. Well, that's all she wrote for tonight. Just had a shower, give myself a little buzz cut. The boys are all gone home, Jacko's gone home. Uh, a hell day out the boat. We'll roll on with the uh, day in the life tomorrow. Um, we'll see you guys first thing in the morning. Good morning everyone and it's day two and it is a bloody beautiful morning I must say. That sun is just creeping up over Mossland right now. Got a few chores to do this morning, get them out of the way and then I'm going to drop a ski in, hope to get a feed for lunch with Jacko and Sam. It's so nice in the mornings out here at Mossland. You'll get to see a bit more of my day to day life and what I do as a YouTuber. We'll get into that and uh, we'll just go from there. And later on, I'll show you this caravan. <laughs> Hello! Good morning! What you been doing, huh? You been doing some exploring? Huh? Hello, straight out, say hello to everyone. <laughs> oh! Did you have a good sleep last night, huh? You were snoring for a little bit? Yes. Go on, go get him! <laughs> What's up, buddy? <laughs> oh, they... <laughs> So my sister's just dropped Bob off for the day. My Bob sit when she goes to work and Sammy's at work as well. Come on through. So what we're gonna do is normally now, um, I'm gonna get in some editing. There's some parcels I wanna open. I'm gonna do a workout and I have a meeting as well, a Zoom meeting, which I gotta do. Lots of injuries that I've gained over the year. Obviously my lung is a big one, so I'm always trying to stay on top of my cardio. But I've also hurt my knee a few years ago surfing. I tore my patella and my niscus, which I've told a few of you guys before. So that's why I, you know, trying to stay on top of my training and all that. So for anyone asking, I use Premiere Pro to edit all my stuff and I still do 100% of all edits you see across all platforms with YBS, myself and everything. I don't have anyone to help me just yet. Editing for maybe two or three hours now and I've got a whole heap of stuff done, which is this episode that you've already watched. It's 11 o'clock now on Friday. Quickly take you outside and I'll explain more about what's going on with this editor stuff. From there, we come through here, da, 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 and you'll find out that I've bought a caravan. The reason I have a caravan is I've finally found an editor that I really like and I want to get him over here, give him a trial and see how it goes. But because town is just so crazy now, busy, tourists everywhere, there's no available accommodations. Welcome, come on in to the new edition. Here we go guys. Check it out. It's actually so sick. I, I love it. I've never had a caravan or lived in a caravan before, but I tell you what, it's got everything you need to be super comfortable. Toilet, shower, washing machine even, and everything. It's, uh, hell guys, it's pretty cool. So that's just a really quick tour. I'm trying to give you as much insight as to what stuff I do and everything like that. So I'm running the business. I'm making the videos, I'm editing the videos, and you know, I'm trying to fit it all in together. Come on, Bob, Shona! <laughs> Woo! The first time any of you guys have ever seen me wear shoes. Get stuck into this, and I'll see you guys in about half an hour. <laughs> These aren't a sample, this is the final product. These are gonna be available in the next week or so. Gonna get a little bit nude. Woo! Dead glassy, baby. Ew! Check out the design. It's so good. And I've got the dead glassy hoodie. It's just got the logo there. Went with a small option on the front there. There's nothing on the back. It's a bit more plain, a bit more subtle for those who like that. They'll be online very, very soon. I obviously gotta go take photos, put them online. Got some new knives that have come in. This is a little bit more of an insight of my day-to-day -day life. Uh, this is the side of running the business that's really enjoyable. Like you get to see your samples that you've been working on for some of them, literally for years, and they're finally ready to put on the shop. Here's an old photo of me and Jackson with a couple of big red emperor we got many, many, many moons ago when YBS first started. Look, it's got the original Youngblood spearfishing logo that we did on Word or something like that. <laughs> Good to keep the memories. See how far we've come. You. Oh, I'll see you soon anyway. See ya. See ya. That was Jacko telling me to hurry up. <laughs> but Dad's just rocked up. And maybe Mum? I think it's just Dad. Who's that strutter? Huh? Me. What is that? <laughs> What's that for? It's my new prototype. Um, assorting well. things in the boot of the jet ski there. What? Oh, up the front there? Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> it's 
<laughs> It'll jump. They're known to jump. Hey, buddy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name's Brody. Whoa, look at him go up there. All right, I think we've got everything. Let's bloody go. All right, I'm gonna get straight into it, get the ski in. You guys have seen me launch a thousand times before, so I won't film it. And I'll just see you guys out there. Fingers crossed we can find some craze. The boys are waiting for me. They reckon they've located some, so I'm gonna get straight out there. It's probably like a 15, 20 minute drive from here. So I'll see you guys out there. <laughs> oh crap, you nearly got smacked in the head by this. <laughs> That's scare you. Yeah. Throw a body. It's only a good one ourselves. Right. The rest are all being good size. Whew. Nice one. That is a nice one there. Ah, it's gonna be good. Right, so this, uh, there's a few there, but that other rock over there had heaps more. Oh, well, I'll just look here and then when you come back. Yeah. Over That's a good one. I don't think they could go anywhere, so we should be able to get a few. Skinner! Back home at Mossland here, and uh, Dad's up to something. <laughs> What's he doing? What are you doing? <laughs> it's been raining so much, like uncharacteristically flooding and all sorts. So Mossland is green, baby. I always love coming home to see what the dogs are gonna do. This is my favorite part. Hello. Hello. Hello Stratus, <laughs> hello Bob, how are you doing? Just like that, the wind has swung direction and this storm has come over there. It's actually raining just on the ranges over there, so that's gonna spring over this way. Vicky is home now and she's gone to what she calls the siesta caravan. So she likes to sneak off and go sleep in the caravan and have a little afternoon nap. Do you need some help? Not yet, but I need to hold the bolts in. Oh yeah, all right, you know, I'll be in, in a second. Well, the sun is setting and it's a bloody beautiful one. There's a storm over there, there's rain. There's a storm over there coming through. And there's a storm over there with some rain. And it's just lighting up right here. I gotta go down into the beach and watch these sunsets with these storms coming through. So just gonna hop on the bike, send it straight down the beach and hopefully catch the last little bit of light. Ew.
lights they've put in up on the shed there. Woo! <laughs> oh, I could not have timed that any better. <laughs> oh, hello! It started raining. I'm soaking wet. <laughs> There we got the fresh red emperor from the other day. Let's get a fill it though. <laughs> <laughs> the fish is going in. Yep. And dad's outside here. Being a master chef. Oh, smoking it out. Some steaks on, crayfish is on there. Woo. Oh, this salad looks good. Some steaks, some chips, some crayfish, some fish. And what's going on over here? is that Sammy just went to Perth and he caught up with my pop and pop gave all these old DVDs from VCR from 20, 25, 30 years ago of all us being grommets, kids growing up and we got them on the big screen here and we're about to watch them. What have you got there? Look at that <laughs> 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 Look, there's me giving the finger. Badass. Oh, look at the weddy. Look at the weddy. <laughs> Another beautiful morning, guys. We've just come down to the beach. It is bloody windy, but so we just hide behind the car, out of the wind, get some sun. This is how we're going to spend an hour or so in the morning. Take Strider for a little bit of a walk and an adventure. And then I'm pretty much going to be in front of the computer for the rest of the day. These windy days, I just make the most of it and I get all the editing done and a bit of business work and all that sort of stuff. That's the other side of all this that you guys don't really see. But uh, I wouldn't change it for the world and I'm definitely not complaining. But thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you enjoyed a bit more of a day in the life of myself and uh, everything that I get up to. I think that was a 48 hour one. I did two full days. If you guys want to support us, you can subscribe. You don't have to, of course. And if you want to get some merch, youngboys.co. These dead glassy range will be dropping in the next week or so, so keep your eyes on that. And uh, that's a bloody wrap, baby. Ew. Thank you so much for all your support. It honestly means the world to me. I'll see you guys bloody soon. Want to say goodbye to everyone? Nope. Okay. <laughs>